Hello, welcome to Triggs Riffs. Welcome to my cat. Um, yeah, essentially this is now a network monitoring cat. So, if they're all on, like they are now, the ping is normal. If the right eye comes on, like now, uh, the ping is slightly high. If the left eye comes on, this is good, <laughs> it means the ping is slightly low. And there is a Knight Rider effect, a furtive look for if it goes any higher than that. It's essentially a lily pad Arduino, which is in the bottom here. Connected up to some LEDs in his eyes. Um, and he just tells you what the uh, network response rate is like. So here's the, the brains behind it. I will uh, attach the, because at the moment it's going through USB, uh, through the FTDI, but I'm going to move it onto the GPIO um, as soon as I can be bothered. Okay, so let's take a look at some code. So here is the lily pad code. Um, so include the serial ports, open 0 and 1 for read write, set up the LEDs, um, and then set their inputs or outputs. So these are all outputs because they're LEDs. Open the serial port with that board rate, and you don't need to worry about that, but it does have some infrared LEDs, which you might be able to see just the purpleness. If my mobile phone's good enough. Is it just purple? Can't quite see it. Anyway. Right, so all I've got is a bunch of functions, subroutines. Um, they just set the LEDs on and off depending on what you want it to do. So let's look right, obviously, because you've got highs on the right, highs on the left, looking left. Furtive look is a pile of them, so you might see like look left, cross eyed, boss eyed, as the LEDs move across his face. And then literally loop forever. Um, and if these characters B, C, F, L, R, A, and O, and F come in, then obviously do the subroutine that it's attached to. So that's the lily pad thing. So that's the receiving end. So that's what turns the LEDs on and off. And over here we have the Raspberry Pi bit, which is literally um, ping a server once and then send these characters to make his face move, to make his lights light up rather. Um, you do need device serial port, um, you do need to make sure, because I'm using USB you have to use that one or your equivalent, make sure this is all set up correctly so that, that board rate has to meet the one on the send side, receive side. And yeah it works, uh, repeat forever, um, ping whatever server, um, those results, send those characters, sleep for a second because why not and then tidy up at the end. So there we have it, and there you have a network monitoring cat. <laughs> Alright, cheers, bye.